Unit Six, Recording One. Countable nouns. Grapes, an apple, a banana, eggs, tomatoes, a sandwich, biscuits. Uncountable nouns. Water, bread, chicken, cheese, olive oil, salad. Orange juice, fruit. Unit six, recording two, one. There's an apple. Two. There are five grapes. Three. There are some tomatoes. Four. There are a lot of bananas. Five. There's some olive oil. Six. There's a lot of apple juice. Seven. There aren't any eggs. Eight. There isn't any cheese. Unit six, recording three. Fruit and vegetables. Herbs and spices. Knife and fork. Salt and pepper. Bread and butter. Fish and chips. Sweet and sour. Tea and coffee. Food and drink. Unit six, recording four. Joe. The name of my favourite restaurant is Fish Kitchen. It's got a great location by the river, and when the weather's good, you can sit outside and the view is really nice. As for the food, well, the name of the restaurant is Fish Kitchen, so obviously people go for fish and chips. It's always busy, and it's very friendly. There are always lots of families. I like it because I love fish and chips. It's not expensive, and it's a great place to go with your friends. Tristan. One of the fantastic things about living in London is that you can get food from all around the world. One of my favourite kinds of food is from Vietnam. Near where I work. There is a really good Vietnamese restaurant. I often go there for lunch. The cooks are all Vietnamese, and they do all the cooking in front of you. The specialty is bún chả, which is noodles with meat and chili and sauce. The sauce is delicious. It's made with fish and vegetables. Mmm, I love it. Kate. I don't like expensive restaurants. My favourite place to eat isn't an expensive restaurant. It's my grandmother's house. She lives in a small town near where I live. I have lunch there every week. My grandmother always cooks a big lunch on Sunday for the whole family. A typical dish for Sunday lunch is roast meat. We usually have roast beef with potatoes and vegetables. I love eating there because I'm with my family. The important thing is that my grandma always cooks with love, so I feel happy there.